so in this question we are going to balance traverse a b c d a using transit rule as we know there are two methods to solve or balance a traverse that is bowditch rule and transit rule so as per the transit rule the correction to latitude is equal to sigma l into l by lt and sigma d is sigma d into d by dt where sigma l is total error in latitude l is latitude of that side if we are finding calculating the correction to latitude of side ab the l will be latitude of that side ab okay so similarly for bc cd and da and lt is the arithmetic sum of the latitudes okay arithmetic sum of the latitude means we won't consider the sign plus or minus we will never consider we will consider only the values you can find the arithmetic sum that is lt sum of latitudes okay so similarly sigma d is total error in departure d is departure of that line dt is arithmetic sum of departures okay so before start doing this problem you can find what is sigma l and sigma d sigma l is the algebraic sum of the latitude okay so you will get sigma l as 0.66 sigma d as minus 0.88 okay you can also calculate the arithmetic sum of latitude lt arithmetic sum of the latitude will give you 520.66 arithmetic sum of the departures will give you 726.78 okay these are the values which is required to solve this problem okay now you can take side ab so for the side ab correction to latitude is i'm not writing the equation again you can look at here correction to latitude is equal to total error in latitude that you know total error in latitude is 0.66 l is latitude of that side how much is the latitude of ab to 18.5 218.5 divided by arithmetic sum of latitude arithmetic sum of latitude you got it as 520.66 isn't it so you will get the value as 0.276 similarly you can find the correction to departure correction to departure is sigma d how much is sigma d 0.88 we are not taking the sign you can take only the value 0.88 into departure of that side departure of that side is 86.8 86.8 divided by arithmetic sum of departures arithmetic sum of departure we have already calculated that is 726.78 okay when you substitute it you will get it as 0.105 okay so here the total error is 0.66 that is positive so obviously the correction will be negative so it is 0.276 here the total error in departure is minus 0.88 so the correction will be plus 
0.105. Okay. So for side BC, we can use the same equation. 0.66 into the latitude of BC. How much it is? 42.16 divided by LT. LT is 520.66 you will get it as 0 0.053 correction to departure is 0 0.88 multiplied by departure of that line BC 314.59 314.59 divided by arithmetic sum of departures that is 726.78 will give you the value 0.38 Okay, so it is 0 0.053.380. Error positive, correction negative. Error negative, correction positive. Okay, so for site CD, correction to latitude 0 0.66 into the latitude of that site CD 209.49 divided by 520.66 it is 0.265 correction to departure is 0.88 multiplied by departure of that side 48.36 divided by 726.78 will give you 0 0.058 and finally the side DA Correction to latitude is 0 0.66 into latitude of that particular site 50.51 divided by 520.66. You will get it as 0 0.064. Correction to departure 0 0.88 multiplied by departure of that site 277.03 divided by arithmetic sum of departure 726.78 you will get it as 0.335 okay I write it over here it is 0 0.265 0 0.058 okay similarly 0 0.064 and 0 0.335 so error positive Correction negative, error negative, correction positive. Okay, now you got the corrections of all the latitude and departures using transit rule. Okay, how can we find the balanced or corrected latitude and departure? The original value is 218.5, the correction is minus 0.276. Okay, so 218.5 minus 0.276 will give you the balanced or corrected latitude okay its value is 218.224 similarly departure is minus 86.8 okay the correction is plus 0 0.105 so the value will be minus 86.695 okay 42.16 minus 0 0.053 is 42.107 314.59 plus 0.38 314.97 minus 209.49 minus 0.265 minus 209.75 48.36 plus 0.058 48.418 Minus 50.51 minus 0 0.064 minus 50.574 minus 277.03 plus 0.335 minus 276.695. Okay, to check the sum of latitude and departure, whether it is 0 or not, you can check find the algebraic sum of the latitude 
you will get it as 0 0.0002 or something you can assume it as 0 again when you find the algebraic sum of the departure you will get it as again 0 0.0002 you can assume it as 0 so now the traverse ABCDA got balanced using transit rule.